hi guys welcome to php tutorial series in this video we will learn about arrays we will learn what are what is arrays and how we can use arrays in our programs so let us go to our editor array is a special type of variable which can store data multiple data of the same type okay uh, let me show you array with the help of example if i talk about a variable like as we discussed before x equals to 1 the value of 1 is gets stored in x but in this this is a variable guys x is a variable okay but one uh, x can store only one value not more than one okay but in the case of arrays array as i said array is a special variable which can store multiple values of the same type so here i am declaring an array okay this is the syntax guys here with the help of arrays i can store multiple values in a single variable see del acer or you know okay since i have taken string here so let us convert this to also okay copy papers see here in this case this is, this is a variable it can store only one value whereas uh, an array is a special type of variable which can store same type of data okay uh, it is not limited to store only one value it can store multiple values i hope you understand guys and this uh, and value inside an array can be accessed with the help of index okay index okay index may uh, like 0 1 2 3 okay each array uh, cell or element will have will be referred with the help of index for example see this is uh, in array the first position of array will be uh, denoted with the help with the help of zero okay first index will be zero and second index will be one third index will be two like this it will increment okay if i take another one like sony then this position will be three okay let me show you this dollar err of 0 let me echo this here I am here I am attempting to print 0 index of this array ok here del denotes 0 position in array so I will get del so just save it and run you can see I got del if I change it to 1, now I will get Acer. See, Acer is display. If I change it to 2, I will get Lenovo. See, I am getting Lenovo. And if I change it to index 3, then I will get Sony. So now you understood, guys. Each element in an array is referred with index, with their index let me explain it once again an array is a special type of variable which can store multiple data of same type see because this data is of the same type it is not storing a different kind of data there is no numbers in this array there is only strings in this array and it is uh, and it is storing multiple values and each value in an array uh, will be referred with the help of index index means position and in array first position will be 0 second position will be 1 uh, and third position will be 2 and fourth position will be four, 3 okay with these positions or uh, with these index values we can access the values of an array okay now i show uh, i will show you all the values at the same time let me put a line break here just copy paste it a couple of times one two and three okay now you can will now we will see i can get 
all the values of an array see i got del acer lenovo and sony okay now i have display now i have accessed each and every element of an array with the help of index uh, okay this is the, this is basic guys we i can get this result with the help of for loops also in our last video i have discussed for loops for loops uh, is a special type of syntax which will execute a set of blocks uh, until a condition gets met okay so let's type our for loop uh, as you know it has three parameters initialize initialization condition and increment and decrement so first will be let us say i equals to zero let us start from zero because our array values starts from zero that's why i have taken i as a zero and then dollar is less than equals to or less than three and then i plus plus okay see guys i have i have started uh, uh, my uh, for loop initialization value as i equals to zero because our i uh, our indexes or position in an array starts from zero and i have given condition as dollar i is less than three because you know in our array we, uh, we have four elements and uh, each element will be indexed from from uh, by its value and first index will be zero second will be one third will be two and fourth will be three so here it's displaying i equals to 0 and dollar i is less than 3 so it will run 3 times 0 1 and 2 and it will display the value now let us type this copy paste it semicolon ok guys here we need to put dollar i sorry guys now if I run this program you will see the same output okay let me first delete it okay now I don't have anything okay unexpected okay, here I have not taken dollar you see I don't have anything now now if I uncomment uh, remove comment and then if I refresh you will see uh, I got three values okay less than should be less than four see I got all the four values see guys uh, this is the, this is how you can uh, work with for loops and array okay I have shown you array also and I have shown you the use of for loops with array okay guys i hope you enjoyed this tutorial or you understand and this concept i will see you in my next video guys uh, if you like this video subscribe to my channel thanks for watching guys